understanding the phrase night watchman hello everyone and welcome to our english language learning series today we're going to explore the phrase night watchman this phrase might sound simple but it carries interesting meanings and uses in english so let's dive in and unravel its mysteries together Night watchman is a compound noun consisting of two parts night and watchman the word night refers to the time after the sun sets and before the sun rises it's the part of every 24 hour period when it is dark on the other hand a watchman is someone whose job is to watch and guard a place especially during the night therefore a night watchman is a person who guards or protects a building, area, or premises during the nighttime. Historically, the role of a night watchman was crucial. Before modern security systems, night watchmen were responsible for keeping a watchful eye over towns, cities, or specific buildings like warehouses, museums, or banks during the night. They often carried a lantern and a weapon to protect the area and themselves. In contemporary times, the term night watchman can still refer to a security role. However, it's often replaced with terms like security guard or night guard. Interestingly, night watchman can also be used metaphorically. In cricket, for example, a Night watchman is a lower order batsman who comes in to bat higher up the order than usual near the end of the day's play. The idea is to protect better batsmen from being out late in the day when they might be tired. In a broader sense, the term can symbolize anyone who protects or preserves something important, especially under challenging or critical circumstances. To fully grasp the meaning It's helpful to see how night watchman is used in sentences. 1. The museum hired a new night watchman to improve security. 2. In times of crisis, he acted like the night watchman of the team, safeguarding their interests. 3. The night watchman patrolled the premises diligently every hour. I hope this video has illuminated the phrase night watchman for you. It's a phrase rich in history and meaning, extending beyond just its literal sense. Whether you're a language enthusiast or a curious learner, understanding phrases like this can deepen your appreciation of the English language. Thanks for watching and see you in our next lesson.